James Kaufman, World News Report, today, September 13, 2024. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Earth to have new mini moon by month's end. This won't be the first and it won't be the last. Researchers from the Universidad de Complutense de Madrid, Ciudad Universitaria, have found that a small asteroid will make one orbit around Earth starting this month before departing back into the other parts of the solar system. This NEO, or near-Earth object, is supposed to orbit Earth for about 53 days, so closer to two months. But that's not the information that JPL has, which we will take a look at. The researchers describe how Earth tends to capture asteroids on a regular basis and outline their calculations showing the path of 2024 PT5 as it comes close to Earth. Prior research has shown that many asteroids fall into partial or full ecliptical paths around Earth before eventually being flung away. Back in 2006, for example, a small asteroid circled the Earth for approximately a year, and another one did so for several years before leaving in 2020. You have probably heard about those many moons. In this new effort, the researchers were looking at a small asteroid that was discovered last month as part of the Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Laser Alert System. Prior research had shown that the asteroid was not on a collision course with Earth, and the researchers suspected it might instead become bound by the planet's gravity for some time. The researchers noted that the asteroid is small, only about 10 meters across. By noting its current size, speed, and path, the pair were able to calculate its path over the next few months. They found that it was going to come close enough to Earth to become bound by its gravity, if only for a couple of months. Their work shows that it will circle the Earth one time, taking 53 days, starting at the end of this month, September, and then leaving near the middle of November. With this said, I found different information at JPL, which we'll take a look at in just a second. In noting its path, the researchers were also able to estimate its origins. They found that it likely came from the Ajura asteroid belt, which is made up of many asteroids with orbits around the Sun similar to Earth's. They also noted and want everyone to know that asteroid 2024 PT-5 is most likely not a piece of space junk, because it has a path that is similar to other objects that have natural origin. With that being released by every major rag in the U.S., let's take a look at what JPL says about this asteroid or near-Earth object 2024 PT-5. All right, this is a basic chart showing the distance of 2024 PT-5 from Earth. As you can see, this chart has its first close approach here at point zero zero four AU which will be between the moon and earth on August fifth. But that date's already occurred. Then it looks like it orbits the Earth and has its next close approach, which they call the closest approach, I believe, on January eighth or ninth. So I can get to it. I think it's the ninth. Well, can we get to it? So, it does actually say the ninth. Hold on. Now, the closest approach, according to JPL currently, is January 9th, 2025. And it's not even as close as, well, we saw the first approach in August. It's actually outside of the moon's orbit at this point. But it does say here, close approach. January 9th, and you can see 2024 PT5 right there. With that said, I don't know who to believe, but I wanted to show you all both sides of the story. Please share, subscribe, and always remember, anything's possible.
bizarro world 